Hello everyone and welcome back for the next episode of Pokemon Uranium! I don't know why I said that. In the last episode we have defeated the first gym leader and even though I said I was going to do this off screen, I completely forgot to, plus I don't have much time. I've only got about um, 50 or so minutes before I gotta get to the bus stop. And uh, yeah. Uh, the main reason for me worrying about getting to the bus stop is because if I miss the bus, I miss my dental appointment. And they're not exactly good about rescheduling appointments there. Um, I don't think I'll ever use Foresight, so let's just go ahead and do that. And I want to give two people on my, uh, two Pokemon on my team a tract. I'm going to give it to Beck, and I'm going to give it to Brock. Uh, the reason being, I want one male, one female with, uh, this, and at least... Forgot to turn my phone to silent. Excellent work! There we go. And at least before, um, Beck evolves, I think at level 28, uh, higher status defense, so it makes sense to have the attract there. So, plus, with static, attract and um, potential uh, paralysis, much better. And with Brock, very defensive, so very much useful to have him. He has no use for Harden. His defense is high enough. Everyone else is fine. I was planning on uh, leveling Tonami to level 10 just to match with the rest of my team, but I completely forgot and remember just before starting this recording that this happens! Hey, it's the brat! I got the better starter. Felix, I had mighty! But you got crushed by the gym leader and now going back to train. Nope! I mean, well, I just took my time to train my Pokemon. I'm gonna beat you. I'm going right and beating the gym leader. Don't expect to win just because your star Pokemon's got the advantage. You know, if you didn't spend so much time with his tongue sticking out. Oh, he does lead with Raptor. Crap. I did not think he would. Uh, at this stage, I think Raptorch might actually have Mud Slap. Yeah, Ember, and he would probably get like Mud Slap, but he's also much, much, much faster than any other starter. I believe Beck is actually the slowest starter, with Raptorch and then whatever the other one's name is. I forgot. It's adorable, but I forgot his name. Kostra. I don't know what that is. I should, but I forgot. Oh, okay, this is the psychic. Uh, this is what will turn into the psychic poison type. Yay, I was wrapped! Woo! I'm guessing this thing knows wrap and poison gas. Or no, just wrap. That's fine. Yeah, this thing eventually evolves into a Psychic Poison type, which is an odd combination. Weak to Ground, weak, uh, neutral to Psychic, weak to Dark and Ghost. Well, it's not a bad combination, to be honest. Now, my new Pokemon can help me win. I'm guessing your dad gave you Kostraw. Because there's no way you can capture one. Yay, I got Rock Smash! One thing I've noticed is the in the inventing, some of the audio cues are completely wrong piece of paper attached to the dear butter as you always linger around town after you left I realized I wanted to give you both of this much teach one of your Pokemon be able to smash rocks hope wondering if you come back to Moki Town after you get your first badge head back to Moki that's actually something that you have to do as well as you may have noticed those rocks uh, near Moki Town I'm gonna give it to him since he's the only one who can learn it but yeah those rocks that we first saw that's the next place we have to go Get rid of Mudslap, since he's not a ground type. Oh, it's odd. With this, it's not invented properly. The audio cues in the wrong spot. You get notified for getting Rock Smash twice, and then after all that happens, the background music for the town does not kick back in. So yeah, that's just some um, difference in all that stuff. Anyway, I will record me going through the rest of this thing again. But unless something really important happens, I'm not going to show it later. Yeah, that was easy enough. Woo. Anyway, this is a boulder, so we need strength to do that. Ha! <laughs> He's trying to hump the boulder. Me, <laughs> me. That. <laughs> Apparently, his sprite automatically switches to running if you hold B during dialogue. That's great. Uh, did I heal? 
I did not. It's fine. Everyone's fine. Except for Lily. Lily needs to get Ember in order to start doing damage. So I'm going to have L Lily lead off. But yeah, we can go this way now. And this will eventually lead us back to Moki Town. It's just that there are more trainers and items hidden along this way, including super potions. And, obviously, we want to fight more trainers, but because we also want to make progress, I'm going to cut these guys out, since they're not really that important. As you can see, you can actually avoid this guy pretty easily, so... And he's also super aggressive. You don't want to see that, do you? Uh, level 8 Mankey, level 9 Tonami. The, the Mankey eventually wound up scratching um, Lily almost to death, but the Tonami, well, let's just say I switched Dish 51 on it and destroyed its face apart with Psychic. Something tells me this guy has fish for me to kill. Water Pokemon are the best! I have one! Alright, that was a level 9 Fortog, level 8 Magikarp. Eh, might as well register you two. But yeah, I wound up getting poisoned by the Fortog before switching, which is just intelligent to me, but he did indeed get Ember, which is the whole reason I wanted him to level. And we're going to go ahead and switch him out and give Brock some time in the field. Because, why not? Although, I do I, I don't know, but that may have been the last Pokemon trainer. Nope, there's a uh, veteran here that we have to fight. Don't even try going into the grass. Same uh, Pokemon as usual. Level 9 Alton, level 9 Chian Monk. Bunch of rock smashes. Killed it. And, uh, yeah, I forgot there's one more fisherman here. We got a repel. That's great. We're probably going to get into a random battle in this last stretch of grass. Nope. Okay. Um... You know what? Fine. You know what? Why not? I've got a little bit of time before I have to go to work. Not to work. To the dentist. No, 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 no. I want to fight this guy. I want to fight this guy. Thank you. I concur! Want a Pokemon of Superior. Never agree to that. That was a level 8 Fortog and a level 8 Spawnee. A Spawnee is basically the same thing as my S'more, except water affiliated. So, as you can see, it would not have been smart for Brock to fight that, because he would have gotten his face blasted apart by water, which is just great. Should be playing with friends instead of being here all day. Well, you're not stuck here. Go. Alright, that was a level 8 Orton and a level 8 Baral, and uh, Beck grew to level 13 in that fight, and as you might be able to guess, learned Thundershock, which is great. I deleted Tackle. I didn't not delete Tackle. I deleted, uh, I think... I don't remember when I delete it. I'm great at this, guys. Uh, let's go ahead and switch all these. Ember, far superior than any other attack he has. Anything else? Nope. We are all set to get back. Now this is something a little bit more memorable. Green me! Green me! Need chicken pep, hey! Make me chicken pie pie green, me! Uh, I'm done acting like Hartman. Heels! Quiet without you around. I asked our neighbors to help set up the internet again. Ah, oh, poor you. Why is Malwarebytes blocking Skype? That makes no sense. It blocked again. That's weird. I guess someone's trying to send pictures? Like, that's really weird. Yeah, I have no idea why. Okay, fine. Exclude the damn website. There we are. Anyway, uh, I guess we we should go to the professor before anything. Oh, hey, there's another um, there's another Beck in there. Got back to safe. So did you beat Maria? You did. That's excellent. I suppose you met the ear as well. Did he give you the HM? Okay, good. Teach it to one of your Pokemon. If you haven't already with it, you'll finally be able to demolish those rocks blocking the way to Route 4 in Boral Town, where you'll find the X bags. Keep up the good work. Please keep catching Pokemon. Thank you for five more Pokeballs. Get out of here. Right, so yeah, you should definitely go to him. He gives you five free Pokeballs. Hey, that's one grand. And this is a great place to train because you get to fight some pretty interesting Pokemans here. Welcome to Route 3. Sounds all tropical. And you get something that Blaine would be very happy about. Burn heals. Whee! Ow. Level 9. That's actually pretty good. As Aryan, get free experience! You need wing attack in like the worst way. I'm gonna speed hack this. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yay! Level 11. 
As you may be able to tell, this is a great place to train Alton. Except for the fact there are Mareeps here. There are also other Altons. I'm gonna charm you before anything. And then I'm gonna quick attack you. I was intelligent, therefore I prevailed. But yeah, this is a pretty good place to train. Your po the Pokemon here range from level 9 to level 11, so this is a good place to wind up increasing your levels, especially because you've got S'mores here, which are pretty good for flying types to gain experience from. And they won't ever have Ember, because I don't believe the S'mores here get to, le to level 11. I crit at you, and now you die! You may be wondering why I'm actually grinding here. Well, I actually do need to. I believe the highest level Pokemon you're gonna... Oh, I was not paying attention! How intelligent of me! I believe the highest level Pokemon you're gonna fight as a against a trainer is uh, level 14 here, so... You kinda need to grind up a little bit. And I think the level 14 is a Basharoon, which makes it even more difficult because I think at that point, Basharoon will have low kick and headbutt. Getting into my indie game development, my latest project is called Pokemon Agat. A gate. That's interesting. I think that's just a shout out to a different developer, actually. So yeah, apparently she can't set up the internet, but she can develop an indie Pokemon title. That that's that makes sense. Hello, Alton! You will die now to further my own Alton goals. Ow. Alright, that's fine. Um, otherwise, yeah. Time to disable the speed hack. So that way they stop going nuts. There we go. And we're going to continue on in the route. Just to get some... We're not going to get all the way through the route, but we're going to get some sort of uh, progress. I believe you might get an old rod here. Oh, no, you don't. I remember where you get the old rod. It's in the route that connects Moki to the other town. Oh, it just gave me a Pokemon to play with. Oh, great. That was a level 10 Fortog, nice and easy. So you may have guessed water is the theme here. Children are durable, but they're a handful. Yeah, I know, she, your daughter just fought me, and now your son's fighting me. That was a level of Grozar, and, and I was wrong, they don't have magnitude, they have Bulldoze, which is actually a little bit more annoying. Luckily, I was able to one-shot him, so it wasn't anything too bad. Do, 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 do. Is there an item up here? No, that's just a ledge, which is a shortcut around here really isn't a shortcut at all, and there's no item up there to my knowledge. Oh, there is! Oh, no! No, oh, I'm not gonna bother with this. Uh, it's just this speed hack. Aha! Speed hack! Save me! A water stone! And now we can go ahead and disable the speed hack again. That way I didn't have to buy repels or do any editing! Haha! <laughs> uh, yeah, I think this is the guy that's got the level 14 either. It's the sailor. You should be working on a cruise ship. Oh, well. Okay, that guy had a level 12 um, spawnee who had Struggle Bug, which I really wish Lily would get. A level 14 Fortog with Acid and a level 13 Magikarp. And as you can tell, Beck took a bit of a pounding in that one, but she lived to fight another day and kick ass another day. I don't know how close I am to the end of the route, so I'm going to burn my Super Potion on her, just in case. Because you saw these guys have up to level 14. That guy had three Pokemon, and one of them was still level 14, so... You don't get to jump over this ledge! Ha <laughs> ha Okay, fine. Why did you get my way? I was training! Alright, that guy had a level 13 Basharoon and a level 12 Mankey, and... Azari didn't get to level 13 in that fight! Azari didn't! Get wing attack. I don't understand why it took me so long to make that conclusion. Anyway, there's another item over here. A repel, that's fine. Now, I can't remember whether you need to stay along the coast or not. Apparently not. <laughs> That's a great answer to my question. I need to get to the next place in this episode quickly. Eh. Stardust! It's just me or is the music going a little nuts here? Aha, I just skipped you, good lady. Snatch! Uh, okay. Now you fight me. Yee! <laughs> Level 13 uh, Alton and level 13 Mary. But that Mary kicked ass! Oh god. Yeah, that Mary was a punisher. Still got some more to get through, and looks like there's a bug catcher up here, so I'm gonna go ahead and heal Lily. 
No, 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 no. Oh, I forgot to start my timer again. We're coming near the end of this episode, but I want to try to get through the rest of this route. I know I said we wouldn't be able to do it, but you know, you never know. Careful use of the speed up function. And by speed up function, I mean cheat engine speed hack. Yay! Ugh, fuck you, I'll register you, you piece of fucking sack. I used the revive on Lily because he got burned from a fellow s'more and then killed, and then immediately after switching back in, she got burned and then critical hit with Poison Sting, which apparently did almost all the damage it needed to, and then the burn finished her off. I am so angry. But please let this be the last fuck- thank you. That was the last little fucker. And because I was exploring... Oh god. That is quite possibly the most annoyed I've been by a random trainer ever. Now we need to get into here just to finish the route. Talk to me, give me free thing. Uh, can you give me free things? Ah, uh, fuck you. Ah, we are here, thank god. We will fully explore this town in the next episode. If you guys enjoyed the video and enjoyed my rage... Uh... Yeah, if you enjoyed the video and you enjoyed my rage, please tune in for the next episode. Make sure to leave me a like, make sure to leave me a comment, guys, and I will see you guys next time for the next episode of Pokemon Uranium. Uh... Uh, still hanging around? Oh. Oh, it didn't give me any indication of... Whatever! Way to ruin my outro, dude. See you guys later. Bye! Ah.